Well, hello, do come in. <laughs> How are you doing? Oh, enough of that nonsense. You obviously can tell what I'm up to here, can't you? Yeah, we're making a Santa suit. Now, obviously, huh, my wife's going to do all that stuff. It's not all done by elves, you know. I bought some uh, fabric to make the belt. And um, if you're uh, a Santa-sized person like me, the fabric doesn't quite stretch. I mean, it does just about. But obviously what we can do is we can hide any extensions underneath the buckle. So it's going to be fine. I was able to buy from our local haberdashery. Haberdashery, there's a term. A foot. So it's five foot by one foot and I cut it in half. And in fact, watching the lady struggle to cut it straight gave me an idea. In fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the, the rubbishy bit, as it were, the one with the, the not so straight edge, to make the bulk of the belt and then make the extension out of this nice neat bit because I'm only going to need enough to sort of indicate the end of the belt. So I'll put a, a point in. Now, in terms of dimensions, um, as I say, I was able to buy this, uh, you know, effectively six inches. So it's two bits of six inches by five feet. That's old money. I put up the, the new money on the screen. Because what you want to do is to have something like four inches, uh, which is about 10 centimeters, as the actual belt. Uh, and I'll show you how to make that. This is the belt material. And as you can see, I'm going to work on the other side, which is great, because you can mark it with Biro nice and easily. Um, now I've made the slot in the buckle 110 mil. Yeah, sort of thinking that around you know the the, the four inch mark, 100 um, mil of fabric. Now what what I haven't decided really is okay, how much am I going to make? Um, I've got to fold this over in a very temporary fashion. I'm going to take that down like that. Sound effects for free. There we go. So that, what we'll do is measure what have I actually done. Never mind what the intention was. What have we actually got in mills? Well, that is, yeah, that's too close to the... Well, no, 105, that's probably about right, isn't it? So what would that look like sticking up through the buckle? Would that look about right? And I'd say yeah, that's going to be good, you know, enough gap, plenty of freedom of movement. So that's what I'm going to mark up um, all the way along this piece of fabric. So I've made a mark there. And come on further off. Mm. Another slurp of me tea. Got to have keep having your tea, and um, <clears throat> that I can go to the far end here and make a mark that is in line with the line that I've already done on one side. That is, hello. So I can actually see that that is very much in line. So that point there is where I've made the mark. And that's very much in line with that line I've made. So I can use that, same principle, guide my ruler in the correct direction. So, time for the hot glue gun. There it is. So what I'm going to do is just put a little dab in a couple of places like that, just to start with, and then fold it on the line as best I may, like that. Again, you, you don't have to do this if you just have the cut edge, but you can see the, 
the whiteness of the underlying fabric when you do that. And I don't want to do that. I'm, I'm trying to make a, a quality belt that looks as good as it can. That's the theory. not to panic as well it does stay hot for a while and actually what I'm finding is that heat um, kind of softens the um, vinyl as well which is great because it sort of it wants to bend where you, you want it to kind of thing not obviously a multi-camera shoot but we'll make it look a bit like one okay so you can see that's as far as the glue's got on there, so we'll get right in the crack there, and you know, a goodly amount, but not too mad. I'm not putting, yeah, probably 20 centimeters, something like that, about 200 mil. Fold it over. There's no, there's no rush. One of the things that uh, I always think, oh, it'll harden before I'm ready. Good enough, I think, for what we need. <laughs>